Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play uh, uh, Super Mario All Stars Edition. Super Mario All Stars Super Mario Brothers. And I and in this part, I will repeatedly forget what the pattern was in this area, as it as is always happens. But it turns out I do not have a time limit imposed on me as to how long I can keep this session of recording long. Although that will still mean I will probably edit this in parts later on, with probably some nice spiffy frame. Uh, let's see. If you don't know what my frames are, they're, they're generally like the game I'm playing but closed up. I might do something where... Oh, oh my god! Yes! Alright. Holy crap. I might do something where I have the Super Mario All-Stars uh, on one side. Oh god! Midget Toads! The world is doomed! Um, but... Yeah, I might do something where I have, like, I think maybe Super Mario All-Stars on one side, and then Super Mario Brothers 1, the box art, on the other side. Fuck. Dang it. And there was me trying to avoid the Buzzy Beetle. That I launched. But yeah, I'm in the last world now. We're in the home stretch. We've killed the last fake Bowser, and we've rescued all the Toads. And they will repay us by being the only guys who fight in uh, uh, Super Mario Brothers 3. In uh, my playthrough of Super Mario Brothers 2, uh, Doki Doki Panic. Oh, dang it. Whoa! Damn, that turtle's on a homicidal maniac. Uh, on a homicidal maniac. No, I don't, I don't care what he does in his downtime, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't do that. I remember this level being harder than any of the other three uh, afterwards. Like, I remember dying on this more than the World 2, or World 3, or even the World 4 on this. Fuck. Oh, dang it, this was the one that actually gave me a life. Why is there a Buzzy Beetle down there? Oh, I was thinking this was the ending. It's not. It's not. Oh, shit, things are getting tense. All right. Come on, don't fuck this up. Woo! Oh my god. Woo! Okay, world two. This one, I remember dying in the beginning and nowhere else. Whoa! I did not expect that to happen and I died to something I should not have died to. Oh my god, did you guys see that? I I want to see if I can do it again. Dang it, I can't. All right, I want to. I, I gotta replay that in like frame by frame. I I th I vaulted onto the fucking uh onto this onto the Koopa Troopa. Oh, th I, two times in a row. Well, technically not in a row. Uh, I did that. Uh, uh, there was one separated where I failed. But yeah. I bolted onto a Koopa Troopa at the worst angle possible, and just barely hitting it, bolted all the way up to the Lakitu, and knocked him clean out. It's really easy to knock out the Lakitu in this version because, um, in this area I should say, because you, you hit the ceiling really fast. It actually might be beneficial to keep a lot of these, uh, whoa, a lot of these, um, right, fuck. Uh, dang. This is one of the trickier jumps. It might be kind of beneficial to keep a lot of these bullet builds alive as, lo as long as possible. Because it seems like when you... When you, uh, don't... When you don't... Dang it. When you... Wh when you don't kill the... The bullet builds, it seems like it's stopping any bullet builds on screen. Like, it seems like they programmed a limit on how many bullet builds can be on screen at once. And that can be very beneficial because if you can, if you know the direction uh, these bullet bills are coming out of, you can keep up with them. And what? Doesn't that count to kill the, the bullet bill? If you can keep up with the direction, it can be a little bit. All right. Yeah. All right. It can be. Uh, it can be more beneficial to have that, just knowing they're not a threat to you. Fuck! Dang it. Uh, to, knowing they're not a threat to you, it could be beneficial because to not have any other bullet bills on screen. Nice combo. I fucking marked out the first time I did that shit. 
as I'm sure you guys just heard. Oh, no, I went way too ahead of it. Please tell me it's still going. Please. No, it's not. Dang it. And the cloud is still smiling at me. Or maybe he's trolling. Oh, my God. Fuck! Dang it. I, I, was, I was trying to land on the... On the bullet bill cannon, but... No! Oh, I thought I was going to do it too again. Dang it. But yeah, that was quite impressive. 69. Alright. Again. Fuck! <laughs> because the spring is so strange in this game. Uh, it, 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 damn it. Ah, shit. As I said, I remember dying in this in the beginning and nowhere else. Yeah, but these springs are so strange in this game. Like, they're kind of iffy to control. Like, I'm sure speed masters, or speed runners, who are masters of this game, got it down. But, no, I don't, and I slipped, and I slid, and I fucked, and I dang it, and I... Crap. City 6. Okay. I wonder if I could pull off the infinite lives trick here. It would probably be really hard because of the lack of just right there on your heels. Has 66 lives. Still decides to go after the one-ups. I heard there was a game actually that um the from the beginning it gives you 1,000 lives but it, you cannot gain any more, and I heard because the game is so balls crushingly hard that by the that just halfway through most people start running out of lives. It's a game that pretty much forces you to live. It's like I said, it's a game that forces you to live with consequences you did, you know, a while ago. Now I understand that for a lot of people that can make, uh. A game feel like a journey. Wow, that was close. Um, but a lot of times it can be really obnoxious because you know s there's always that one bullshit thing in a in a level. All right, peace. Okay, level three. What was level three here? Because I completely don't remember level three, or at least not off the top of my head. Oh, oh no, I remember this. Hammer Brothers. That's all. Fucking Hammer Brothers! Shit. God. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna get past him because I don't want the Hammer Brothers at the death of me. Oh, jeez. Am I mortal enemy? Sh oh, dang it. And, uh, escapes mortal enemy. Dies by Koopa Troopa. Dies by his cousin. Alright. Alright, kill them both. I'm actually... Ground level Koopa Troopas are the hardest because, like, obviously there's no real way to kill them other than landing on them. But it's really hard to land on them when they're throwing hammers. Fuck! See what I mean? Like, right there. Just claw hammer. Boop! Right up your butt. And that did not feel pleasant. Not at all. Uh, and shit. I don't think it's beneficial for me to have this here. It's actually limiting me because I can't run as fast. Shh. The fucking wooden tip of the hammer hit me and it killed me. Son of a bitch. Right, uh, I'm making dumb mistakes now. Like, this is what hits you when you're being frustrated when you're, um... This is what kind of annoys me about this game. As much as a lot of the challenges is well done, um, a lot of it is just random shit like the Hammer Brothers and Bowser. Like, that's what's been my, my biggest uh, problems here. It's just Bowser and the Hammer Brothers. Actually, no! The, the randomness of Bowser is because he throws hammers! So, no! It's not, it's not, uh, it's not, it's not one, it's not two things, it's one! It's hammers! I dislike hammers now. Fuck! He jumped up when he wasn't supposed to. Dang it. Oh my god, Castle Gates. 
shit. I saw like Game Center CX where he was trying to play Super, uh, where he was trying to play Ghosts and Goblins, and like uh, he fucking died. I think he said he had actually rode out 93 times to the Red Armor or the Red Devils, if you will. See what I fucking mean? Ah. <sighs> Leave me alone, bullet bills. Alright, good. I can get past these guys. Oh shit, these guys are still on my tail! Yeah, these snipers work from a distance. No! I wanted to go onto the edge. Fuck. Dang it. Th usually they're kind of programmed not to, like, immediately uh, shoot out when you're that close, but I think it was because. They, they probably got the com it probably started the animation like before I was right next to it. All right. All right, come on, come on, get past it. Get past yes, all right. This is I think this is the farthest I got. Yeah, because I didn't face up against just the regular hammer Cooper before. Fuck no! I didn't want to run that high. Shit. Please tell me I hit a midpoint. No! No checkpoints! I'm sad. Fuck, yeah. Okay, never mind. I remember this stage now, but I, I think it kind of blurred in just generally with the hatred of Hammer Brothers. Oh, fuck. I remember in other versions of the game you can jump over them, but I guess not this one. Oh, yeah, and this is another thing. Um, in other versions of Mario Brothers, like, once... The, the the timing of the hitboxes on a lot of these enemies are a lot different. Like, even though an enemy might be out, you, they, you're they you not going to get harmed by them. Not in this case. It's pretty much as literal as it can get, and I just died unnecessarily because I missed the jump button. Fuck. Shit, when did I start with 89 lives? And now I'm down to fucking 54? Did he just shoot two in a row? Dang. Wow, all right. Come on. I actually kind of like this uh, this added touch of the castle gates. It's a little too calm to be ba continuous with the look of- Fuck! With the look of Bowser's castle in Super Mario Bros. 3. But it does give you the impression that you're entering a stronghold. Even if it is quite a long gate. Fuck! Dang it. Dang it, Hammer Brothers. The Hammer Brothers, they're, they're messing with me. Jeepers. Actually, I, I don't even actually know why I did that. I'm... Th this game is causing me to play worse. This happens a lot when you play games that you just play a little too much. Like... Your, your skill starts to get really good, and then you just hit the roadblock, and you just fuck up everything. Um, but then you, uh, but then eventually it starts to get so frustrating that you just get mad and impatient and do much worse at everything. And then all of a sudden, you beat it all at once. Shit, this is such a clusterfuck of hammers. Oh my god. Damn it! Fucking piranha plants! Shit. Oh my god. I've beaten battle toads and this is kicking my ass! Holy shit. Super Mario Brothers! He's kicking my ass. And I still gotta get through to. Fuck. Super, uh, Super Mario Brothers 2 Japanese! Oh my god. Like the first le like the first sec the second world is as hard as this one in uh in Japanese Super Mario Brothers 2. So, yeah, the, I, I'm not going to have a good day when I whenever I get to that. I think I'm going to do that last. And then eventually like if I do get too frustrated, I'm just going to say fuck it. Oh wait, wait, wait. I remember I could kill Yes. No! Fuck.
I wanted to back away specifically to get away from any hammers, but I backed away into a hammer. Shit. Oh, dang it. I should be trying to call the time, my own uh, personally given time limit, and just say like, uh, that's gonna be it for this part. But yeah, I'm I'm not cutting it to the next part until I get to Bowser's castle, because Bowser's castle I don't remember shit of how to get to Bowser, and I remember it's kind of an unnecessarily long uh, and confusing quest. You son of a bitch! Get over the hammers. All right, got it. Oh, all right, please, please, please don't have enough frame data to. Fuck! No, 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 no. That did not just happen. Did not just happen. I am erasing that memory from my mind. I just realized there are no lives in this level. There are no coins. Assuming I had fucking three continues, I would have been screwed. Uh, if I only had three, uh, three lives in this game, I would have been done. There just would have been no chance in hell. Fuck. Oh my god! Oh my god, I killed them with the power of happiness. Oh my god. I killed them with their own brothers. This is like, like, look at you. Fuck. Alright, if you look to your brother on the left side of you. Now imagine if somehow someone walked into your house, grabbed his body, uh, and started beating you to death with it. That would be what I just did. To them. Yeah, actually, no. Um, they did something similar in um, I think it was Jason X. Someone was uh, sleeping on the in a campsite, and they picked up their body and started uh, uh, hitting them, uh, hitting them against another guy who was sleeping in a sleeping bag. Hilarious and gruesome. Fuck, come on. Dang it! Having difficulty, uh, keeping close to, um, Hammer Brother without actually hit, uh, touching him. I'm not touching him, I'm not touching- oh shit, I got touched. I'm dead. This is what always annoys me about just video game logic, like, if, uh, if touching a certain character is dead to the touch, shouldn't it be the other way around as well? Like, shouldn't the Hammer Brother also die? Like, and the reason I would, and I can understand for this sort of game, you could argue that one person's touch, oh my god. You could argue that one person's touch may have, like, spines or something that hurt them. But with games where characters are ascent, fuck, I made myself die. But in characters where games are essentially equals, a lot of times you'll still get cases where, uh, touch, uh, your, uh, two characters touching each other only harms one. For example, in Mega Man uh, 1, there's an instant where you get a copied Mega Man that you have to fight, but, you know, touching him only damages you. Why? It's not fair. Fuck. Oh my god. Holy crap. Come on. Yeah, okay, okay. Pass the section. I don't know any of the secrets that I'm sure some other people know in this area. So, fuck. Dang it! Two in a row with no mushroom. Dang it. Okay, I, I think I have to kill the... The freaking Hammer Brothers here because I gotta get a mushroom in this area because I cannot continue without it. Okay, I found it, and I got killed. Because this motherfucker was... Picked up a hammer and pointed it up. And I died. Ah. <sighs> oh, fuck. Finkel and Einhorn. Einhorn and Finkel. Shit. Oh, God, no. I'm, I'm not gonna get game over, am I? Well, if I do, there's like a... a fucking... There's a, a buzzy beetle at the beginning. Like, what am I gonna title this episode? I think, gonna, I'm, I think I'm just gonna title it fucking I Hate Hammer Brothers. 
I might do something worse than that. I might just write, I hate motherfucking Hammer Brothers. Shit. I can never figure out their AI because, uh, similar thing with Bowser. And actually, I actually might think Bowser and these guys have the same AI because they have kind of similar pattern movements. And I just never figured it out. Killed him. Got him, alright. Alright, alright. Supa Mario Brada. Okay. I really wish I had the Fire Flower. And the thing is, this this gives you an extra hit, but it makes it harder to face the the uh, Hammer Brothers. Because you can leave a gaping hole where uh, they can hit you. Alright. They're dead. This should give me more time, especially with how patient you have to be to take care of the, uh... Dang it. Let's take care of the, um... A Hammer Brothers. No! Of all the things I could have lost the dang mushroom to. It had to be my own shot, Koopa Troopa. Fuck. Ha. <sighs> Oh my god, my hands are sweaty. See what I mean about me being frustrated and just getting impatient? <sighs> Shit. I don't even think I was this frustrated with fucking Battletoads. Then again, I I played Battletoads barely a week after I beat it the first time. So a lot of the my knowledge was really fresh, whereas this, it's been a while since I played this version. And it's even been a while since I played the original Super Mario Brothers. Oh, dang it. Fuck. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can... I'm gonna see if I can search all of them to see if I can find a... Uh, mushroom, because it might be on the right... Ah, oh, dang it, I have to go around it and cause them to disappear. I'm trying to see if I can find anything. Oh, I was hoping he would bounce back and kill him, but he did not. Fuck, I went too far. Oh, damn it. Shit. Oh, you dirty bitch! Come on. Son of a motherfucker. Oh, God. Ah! Gah! Fuck. Ah. Here I am trying to expand my vocabulary. Well, actually, I haven't really done it. Oh, my God. That was close. Fuck. I'm not really doing anything to deliberately expand my vocabulary. I'm just trying not to use the same words over and over again. As is often the case with so many swears. No, no, oh, okay, good. Come on. Alright, please. Alright, good. I can check. Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Fair fight now. I'm acting so damn careful right now. 
It's not even funny. Holy shit. Damn, okay, that was actually quite cocky of me. Don't get too cocky, Star Fox. That leads to too much masturbation. Oh my god, is this the end? Is this the end? Holy shit. I fucked up the jump, but I don't care! I beat this damn level! Oh my god. Holy crap. Holy goodness. Holy Jesus. Holy mother on earth pearl. Next time on Let's Play Super Mario Brothers All-Stars Edition. I'm gonna beat this damn thing. Bowser, I'm coming for you, sucker. <laughs>